Hello everyone, uh, David Ginter here, and this is Name That Pick. And uh, it's basically a, a spin on the genre of games that uh, it's a puzzle, um, a picture that's scrambled or hidden, and uh, you have to um, try and guess it. Uh, the twist on this game is you can actually use Facebook um, and challenge friends and send your own pictures and create the puzzles yourself. So right over here, if you click right here, um, I'm using the simulator, but if you clicked here, it would ask you to um, select a video, and then in the next step, you would actually write what the uh, the word is that has to be guessed, and uh, it would integrate with your Facebook, and you could pick um, any friend and, and challenge them to the app or, or to the uh, uh, to the puzzle. Uh, it's got some preloaded ones in here, and you could put as many as you want in here. It's pretty easy, uh, including the instructions on how to do that. Um, if you click here, here's an image, it's scrambled, and you can move these around. And once you get it, um, you just type in the word, and this happens to be Titanic. Uh, it has the same concept. You earn coins. You can actually do in-app purchases. Uh, there's one, two, three, four, five of them built in. You could price them any way you'd like. Um, you can buy hints with the coins. You could set these limits uh, however you want. Um, your audio options, uh, mute or not. Um, Facebook, you can get a hint. Uh, post it on Facebook for your friends. You have some good um, built-in marketing. It also times the level so you can challenge people to beat your times. And if you go back to the main screen and hit settings, you can actually select how difficult the puzzles are. So if I set it to four, now it's a four by four screen. And I can also go in there and change it to the least difficult, which is two by two. And see, here we go. And this one's pretty easy. And this is Lincoln. And like I said, every one of these is customizable. You can change the graphics here and make it anything you'd like. You could put photos in here. You could put um, graphical drawings in here. It's up to you. Um, really, it's a it's a pretty easy reskin, and it's going to save you a lot of time. And I hope you like it. Um, hopefully, you buy it. Uh, hit me up on theskinman.com. That's my website, theskinman.com. And I'll be posting more codes as we go along. There's also going to be a Android version of this as well. So take care.